This outdoor installation is great because in this case, we've taken up no room inside the house. That's right, Andy, and there's some other great benefits to using this type of product. First of all, your exhaust vent is right here on the front of the water heater. There's no additional venting components or vent system required. Well, that just makes the installation all that much easier. It sure does. Some other things we've done here, we've used a conduit to wire the water heater directly to a junction box with an on-off switch. Okay, weatherproof. That's right. Okay. We've also insulated the hot and cold water lines. This is also a good time to point out, the water heater itself is equipped with a freeze protection device to minus 30 degrees. Well, that would certainly cover almost any climate, I think. Yes, it does. A few other considerations when installing an outdoor model. It's always a good idea to make sure that you maintain clearances from any doors or windows. Guidelines for this are included in the use and care manual and also check with your local codes. It's also important to maintain any clearances for the air intake and the exhaust vent. You don't Keep want those any, clear. That's right. You don't right. want any shrubbery or anything else in front mm -hmm. of there. Finally, you can also install the water heater close to the hot water fixture that's most frequently used. That eliminates any long pipe runs. That's great, yeah. Now how about the controls? The remote control we wired inside the home close to a hot water fixture. It's a great feature. Yeah, okay. That's an ideal installation. Thank you.